Good afternoon, everyone. Welcome to North Star Knife Reviews. Today, I have a knife for you that is from about World War II. Uh, I don't know if you can guess what this is, just taking a look at it. Give you a minute. Take a look at the outside before I let you know what it is. Let's see, we've got some nickel silver bolsters, steel liners and steel back springs. I believe that the covers are Delrin, and I'll talk about that in just a second. But this knife is made by Queen. This is a Queen City number 10. And this Tang stamp indicates that it was made somewhere between 1937 and 1945. Now, I think I can narrow that down a bit more because uh, Queen, there's a Queen Historical Society online. You can take a look at a lot of these knives. And the description of this knife talks about it having brass liners. Well, this one obviously doesn't have brass liners, it has steel. So that suggests to me that it's probably somewhere between 1942 and 45 because brass was being used for munitions in World War II. And so they would have used steel instead to conserve the brass. So that's why I'm going to guess this is probably made actually during World War II. The blade length on this is a little over two and a half inches. Cutting edge about two and a quarter inches on the main blade. Uh, you can see that the tip of this has been broken off and it has had a fair amount of use. It's got a little bit of a recurve that's been put in it from uh, the use over the years. But listen to this. That snap still, after all of these years, uh, still working very, very well. Same on the secondary blade. This one hasn't been used as much. This little pen blade. This is a little over two inches with a little under two inch cutting edge. The number 10 is a, I love that noise. Uh, the number 10 is a swell end jack. Now, as I said, I believe these handles are Delrin. Uh, there is a photo online uh, of one of these old number 10s that talks about it having uh, the original version of the winter bottom bone. And that knife has bone handles, bone covers. Looks very much like this, but I don't believe this is bone. Uh, to me, it feels like Delrin, um, but it still does have, you can see it's been pocket worn quite a bit, but it still does have uh, that same jigging on it. So this would be apparently, from what I've seen online, the original version of the winter bottom pattern that uh, Queen used quite a bit. Pretty good shape. Um, I mean, the, the blades have been worn and used quite a bit. So obviously this was in somebody's pocket a lot, but that spring, uh, you know, you've still got a great walk and talk on this. Speaks to the quality of these knives that it still has us at, after that much use and after that many years. Really a nice knife. Glad I was able to pick it up. Hope you found this interesting. Thank you very much for watching. Have a good day.